what's up you guys i just wanted to share my thoughts with you real quick accept me for how i am right now bitch i am not my hair okay don't be trying to judge me shit let me sit back and talk my shit shall we i was just listening to something on youtube and it just made me sit back and think how many psychos have i created because i sexed them the fuck down like do y'all know how dangerous fucking sex is now let's 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 really talk here let's explore this conversation a little bit more let's go a little bit in depth now there are people out here in this world that they thoroughly enjoy sex sex is a very passionate adventure for them every time they go into the gusto they are going for the gusto bitch they going for the motherfucking gusto they gonna knock your boots off they gonna knock your socks off they gonna spin your head around back we're gonna make your booty percolate bitch they's about to knock your shit loose Baby, by the time they finish with you up in that bed, baby, you gonna think you a fucking paraplegic the way your shit all locked the fuck up up in that motherfucker, bitch. Those are motherfuckers that is serious. Look, sex is a serious art. And them is some dangerous motherfuckers. I'm included. Them is some dangerous motherfuckers. Because I'm. there's too many lazy people sexually. There are too many pillow princesses is that what they call them like the ones that just want to lay down on the pillow and expect the band to do all the work there and, and and as a female i know a lot of lazy ass men that every time you want to have sex with them they always pulling you on top and like the female is doing the majority of the work so there's a lot of lackluster motherfuckers out here so that's why a lot of people are over the whole size thing especially for females you know you got to have a certain size and everything yeah you do got to have certain girthage and certain size okay we ain't going like let y'all get away too easy like you gotta you got you gotta bitch you better sometimes it ain't the size of the person sometimes just looking at a female you can't tell sexually if she is the motherfucking don daughter or not because it may be a girl i you I've spoken to men on several occasions that they have told me that the one that they fell in love with or that did it for them sexually is not the one that you see them with every day. It is not the one that you would think. It's the big girl. I, let, hey, shout out to my big girl. Let me try. Look, y'all be eating. <laughs> I've never heard a nigga that be fucking big bitches that do not say that them bitches do not be slobbing and bobbing while they giving them dog and an aubin. Bitch, I've been taking notes because I, look, I already know y'all bitches is the truth, okay, bitch? And ladies hang around some gay niggas too. They teach about that, about that, about that suction girl, about, about the suction girl. And how to get past that gag reflex. I'm just trying to, I'm trying to educate you. But see, this is when it gets serious, okay? Because we have so many people that have lackluster sex that are literally just waiting to lay there on the bed like a pillow princess and want someone to dust their boots off. Because we have so many mediocre people out here, when you really run up on a sexual goddess, a sexual entity, a soul snatcher, a soul snatcher, a soul developer, bitch, I will, bitch! Bitch, I will fuck your world up. Listen, these men and these women out there that are very confident. And look, I know. Listen, don't you know no good, bitch? I know. I know. That's why I don't be fucking everything that want to fuck me. Because I... There's certain principalities and responsibilities when you know you got good stock level pussy and good stock level dick now. I'm not playing like there's too many mediocre motherfuckers out there. And if someone has just been... Skibbing, skibbing through life. Skibbing, bitch. Got a little two step, but you just skibbing. They ain't really down there hitting, hitting no Chris Brown, no Jane Brown move. Just they ain't, they ain't, they ain't really had nobody glide across that dick like that. Nothing like that. Once they done got past the skibbing and you went in, and you done came over here and you danced fevering on the dick. Cause she's a private dancer, dancing for money. Dude, bitch, what you go over there, motherfucker? <laughs> <laughs> that shit will fuck some my head up. I swear to God, that shit is like a drug addiction. It is a drug. Do I? It, it just hit me. Sex can be extremely fucking dangerous, bro. You have to be responsible because if you give your good, good sex, and a lot of people know. I don't know about nobody. I know me, and I know a lot of people be thinking I be talking shit. I am fucking not. I'm a Scorpio. 
I take pride in, in my did look, look I'm an artist and I'm sensitive about my shit bitch I'm a motherfucker artist I be on your body motherfucking painting Picasso okay bitch bitch you gonna leave my motherfucking humble abode feeling like a whole nother new nigga bitch how much wood chuck chuck up a wood chuck bitch all of it all of it now, nigga, what the fuck are y'all talking? What is y'all? Y'all need to raise your standards. So either we need to do something, okay? Either people need to raise their standards and get and, 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 and step their sexual expertise up and not have such mediocre garbation floating around. Cause I don't know. Oh, we gonna have to like scale back the good good. Don't you know no good? I know, bitch. I know. I need to scale it back. I can't be just fucking and, and, and doing, I, especially not the, 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 not the mouth. Because I done got to the point where my stuff, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you can have sex with somebody and not mean nothing. But once you get that um <clears throat> head and shoulders, like, I listen, head, shoulders, knees, and toes, nigga, your knees and toes going buckle, bitch. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, buckled. And you put the good pussy, you put the, look, let me love you down. Hold on, you give me the 80s pussy? Don't let it be no young digger, the 80s pussy. Let me. It's a drug addiction. It is literally like heroin. I don't know if you know this. I know that I know this. I know I done been addicted to some dick before. And I, uh, I, had to, I had to get myself to... Bitch, I still be having flashbacks to this day. To this day. So we got to be responsible, y'all. It just hit me listening to this lady on the interwebs. Just how dangerous sex is. And sex is fucking dangerous. It is fucking... It's too much mediocre bullshit going out here. And maybe we should just separate... Is there a way to separate, like, I mean, because, like, listen, Linda, because you run back into this world thinking you're going to find something like me, and you run against all this mediocrity. And now, 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 and now, I can't, I can't get rid, like, it's, it's about four, five motherfuckers, especially the retrograde, it's about four, five motherfuckers. And I hate all three of you. I wish I never touched you. You understand what I'm saying? It, 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 it's my fault. It's my fault. It's my fault. Can't be loving. You can't. I don't know how to be any other type of fucking way. I don't know how to do it any other way. That's just me. Especially if I'm drunk and I got some fucking Hennessy or some fucking Quavo in me, bitch. Let me just. Uh, uh, are you fucking kidding me? You mean I have to remind myself to fucking scale down my amazingness because y'all bitches is out here mediocre? What? And now I got, now these niggas wanna, won't leave me to fuck them all? Shit! Because you know what, this is why the Bible said you're not supposed to have sex till marriage. Uh -huh. This is why. I'm gonna let y'all know something. I'm about to move. I'm about to change all my numbers. I'm about to probably change my alias and every. I'm listen. I'm about to start wearing wigs. Everything that you know, Reds don't do. You know, Reds be getting on here doing that. I'm about to change up because y'all ain't about to know me no more. I don't want y'all to know me no more because too many motherfuckers know me and know too much about me. I appreciate the love, but 